welcome back to RuneScape Quest 72. One small favor. I've said two. <coughs> Hello, do you need any help? Talk about one small favor. Yeah, I need to talk to you about chicken cages. Um, Seth Groats has asked me to come and see you. Hmm, Seth, uh, he's a good friend, but he still owes me three seal bars for a plow I fixed. So I wouldn't have that paid off your wrist before I can do any more work for him. Okay, well, I have three seal bars here. You can have these. Okay, then great. Tell me a little more about these chicken cages. <coughs> or rather, cough, cough, cough. Oh, dear, you don't sound too well. No, I'm not actually. I'm quite ill. Oh, that's a shame, because I really need your help to make some chicken cages. I'm sorry, but I... What's I can manage today is simple trading. However, if I was to get some medicine, say, I could be persuaded to you, um, to do you a small favor. Oh, I see. You need me to do you a favor. Well, just one small favor, and then I'll do you a small favor. Okay, I guess one turn, good turn deserves another. Oh, that's jolly decent of you, my friend. I need some medicine. Could you get me some herbal tincture and breathing salts? That's just all my ailments. Well, hopefully I'll be right back, but you never know. It might take longer. That's great. I must warn you, it'll be a lot easier for me to simply adjust some existing pigeon cages. If you have any five or so of those, that would help a lot. First things first, bring me that medicine. I like how it's literally like, you know, there's a Karamja section, then we're in a Mithalin section right now. Or I don't know. I am the Apothecary. I have potions to be. Do you need anything specific? Horvick is any breathing salts and herbal tincture. No problem. Well, I can show you the herbal tincture. Here you go, there's your herbal tincture. Well, that was surprisingly easy. Fantastic, thanks very much. No problem, please to help. Oh, but what about the breathing salts? Oh, yes, breathing salts. Are, um, just let me look around. I'm sure I have some around here somewhere. Oh, no. Okay. What, what is that? Oh, that's a periodic table. Yep, here they are. It's a jar of breathing salts. Oh, blimey, I've dropped the pot and smashed it. That's okay, just hand over the breathing salts. Oh, no, you don't understand. They're ruined. So you kept an airtight container, and this was my last one. You don't order more and, until I get a new airtight container, and they were a top-selling item as well. I just knew this was going to be easy, so you can't get any more breathing salts? No, I can I can order plenty, but they'll lose their effectiveness. I need an airtight pot to keep them in. Where would you get one of those from? I have no idea, really. This pot was a family heirloom. Do you have to go may have and get a new one made? Where could I do that? You could try Tassie slip. This guy's like, oh, bow, bow. uh, you know, wow, that that was awful. Just he's so surprised. Try Tassie Slipcast over at the Barbarian Village. She's a potter there. Maybe you'll have to make one, but mine has to be airtight. Oh, okay, I guess it's not that far to the Barbarian Village. What about I'd really appreciate it. Yes, I can. <coughs> okay, I'm going to go 
to Varak again. Actually, no. Just go to Grand Exchange. Fluffs. Well, again. Oh, my dear, how are things? Do you have any more kittens? Did I have their 100 coins each? Do you want one? Morgana? And I forgot, I can actually... I don't remember if it's Ring of Karos E that I have to use. It might be E. <coughs> I think it might be normal one. So funny enough, you can actually just buy <coughs> an airtight um, pot, but you have to do um, all the favors first. Why is it saying herbal antidote here? It says herbal tincture in the thing. Anyways. You? I don't even know if you existed. Actually, you might have existed. It's a potter and, um, drainer that didn't. Hey there, I need an airtight pot just as soon as you can make one. I beg your pardon. It's a medicine emergency that I've an airtight container just as soon as possible. What on earth do you think you are coming here demanding an airtight pot? Can't you see that I have my own worries to think about? Oh, sorry, I didn't think. What's the problem? Well, if you must know, I'm working all the hours at Sarah Doman sends to, in order to make enough money to pay that loan shark hammer spike. Loan shark? Hammer spike? What are you talking about? I took over this abandoned pottery place with a loan from hammer spike. He's demanding payment, and I can barely just make the interest payments. As hard as I can, but I'll never pay the loan off at this rate. But I need an airtight pot to store breathing salts in. Well, that may be, but I have a rush order for a top paying customer that's going to keep Hammer Spike off my back for a bit. If you really want that pot, you're going to have to deal with Hammer Spike in the door of mines. Oh, sorry. No more blooming flavors for anyone. Can't deal with Hammer Spike. Really? You will? Yeah, so go and have a chat with him. Perhaps we can sort something out. That'd be really great. I just hope he doesn't grind you into flour to make his bread. One of the most ruthless gangsters in the area. Beware, his guards are incredibly old. They slit their own throats to protect them. Well, that's not a pretty picture you're painting, but don't worry, I'll be careful. Now, where do I find this hammer spike? He's in the door of mine somewhere. Not sure exactly where, though. Oh, yeah, you switched to trying your hand at instrumentation. Oh wait, I just realized there might be a problem. Wild Gothic Sleeps might not be completable. <coughs> Unless I do the quest after it first. I just realized that because that might require the amount of quest points that were released at the time. And of course I can't do um, Death of Chivalry just because, you know, that, that is a very 6th agey quest. Boot. Both game member, how you doing? Yeah, what do you want? I'm looking uh, for hammer spike. Hey, is there any somewhere? Just use your eyes. I'm sure you'll get there one day. What are you doing here? Well, as if it's any of your business, I'm an associate of hammer spike. He's a great dwarf, you know. You could learn a lot from a dwarf like him. What do you work for? We're not going contract with Hammer Spike. When he gives the words, the hammer starts flying. 
Let's like to stop you. And who the heck are you? I'm Cook Link, and I want to talk to you about a friend of mine, Tessie Slipscat. She says you're putting the screws on there for some loan she had from you. Is this true? And what if it is? Yes, he got into an arrangement that is mutually beneficial as far as I understood it. She was happy with the deal. Come on, um... Do something nice for Tessie. I think about how hard she's working. Well, now you can come to mention, I guess I have been a little hard on the girl. Yeah, come on, give her a break. And yeah, I guess I'm quite stressed out about things, what well, was so much to think about recently. I can understand that. You've a lot on your mind. Go on, make a change. It'll do you good. Uh, there must be something else that you wanted to do at least once in your life. Hmm, yes, yes, you're right. I didn't want to do something, uh, something I noticed recently. But you laugh, I would tell you. Nah, it's silly. Have you always been a gangster? Wasn't there anything else you wanted to do inside? Come on, tell me what you want to do. I'm listening. Oh, I was just thinking the other day that I'm feeling sort of unfulfilled in my life. I'd like to get rid of all this anger and frustration that my current lifestyle brings and do something relaxing. Like those druids. I mean, all day sitting around looking at herbs and wearing robes and stuff. Okay, that sounds good. Yeah, yeah, I really want to be a druid. So, go and see the druid leader. I think Sam fuses his name. Then have to take me in his initiate. Do me this one small favor and I'll leave Tessie alone. Okay, another favor? I think I can manage that. Good. I mean, great. Come back when Sephi has agreed to take me as an initiation. What? What did he say? He said something. Get used to that sight. Hey, you are Sanfi. Um, are you taking new initiates? Hmm. Are you considering yourself? Do you accept dwarves? Dwarves? Well, no, that's a mighty interesting question. Because we haven't before doesn't mean they say we shouldn't. A dwarf right now wants to become an initiate. Oh yes, well that's interesting. Let me think for a moment. Hmm, yes actually. Might take him out so long as you can do me just one small favor. Well too actually. That's new. Not you as well. Stop interrupting me, I haven't told you about these favors. This poor little gnome up on the White Wolf Mountain. I wonder if you could take him a warming potion. I have the recipe here. That seems simple enough. In addition, how long would you take a trip down to see those ogres to the south of Unil and bring the word of Guthix to them? Hoping you might organize this trip with a gnome pilot up there on the White Wolf Mountain. Are you mad? Well, perhaps a bit, but it's never stopped you doing things for me before. I've been asked to do a lot of favors recently. Well, that's a life and adventure. Is it a deal or not? Yep, it's a deal. Uh, tell me the recipe for this potion. All you need to do is add clean Harlander to a vial, then add clean Marimental oil. Warm that poor fellow up a treat. Hmm, sounds delicious. What's it called? We call it Guthic's Rest. Can I drink it? If you want. Great, and thanks. We'll just have to make another one for the gnome. But I can drink it, though. Yes, but you have to make another one for the gnome. Okay, I think I understand. So that's actually... I get. I think that actually unlocks Guthic's Rest, then. That's it.
Horrorlander. And that to make Guthix's Rest. You make a lovely fresh batch of Guthix's Rest for the Gnome Pilot of White Mold Mountain. Yeah, Guthix Rest used to be drink from a teacup. Oh yeah, I completely forgot about you. Jasmine, I guess? Yeah, Jasmine the Purple Cat. Just because that's the name of the other kitten that we found. Will you shove off, mate? Uh, I don't know why... I I have the ruins, why? Why is that? Uh, I have a special potion for you from Samfew. Oh, many thanks, Burr. Blimey, it's cold up here. Now have I all right with Rex? Well, I mean, it's certainly jolly decent that old stick savvy to get this to me and make me that potion. It really does chase away the chills. Yeah, he's quite considerate the way, you know, thinking about people. In fact, he was thinking that you'd be able to help him with another little helping situation that involves ogres. Ogres? Hmm, well, I guess they're just overgrown gnomes when you think about it. More like super overgrown gnomes, if you ask me, or overgrown humans. Quite. Anyway, go on. What was Sam for you after? Some of you wants to bring the word of Guthix to those ogres, so I have no idea if Guthix even have the ability to grasp Druidic concepts. Yes, quite, but who amongst us does? I know I'm often confused by the beardy bunch of yakking druids. And he wants to know if he can organize a glider route down there. Hmm, interesting. I know that the elders wanted to extend that work of glider routes, and I did hear that the felt of heels were being considered. I don't know why it hasn't opened up yet, though. And I'm going to transfer that yakking druid down there to the ogres. I'll want to make it in record time, so I'll need some lighter kit. Okay, good luck with that. A chap called our human Catherine. I've heard that his special interest in ships has helped him to produce light weight, but strength and ropes, I'm in need of some trash. T R A S H. I need you to get it for me. Trash? What the fuck you? you know, why do I have to get it? I'll talk about that. Oh, thank you, Wolf. The next generation of lightweight ropes, triple redundant aero super hauser. Trash! It'll try. Thanks, Wolf. And a potion. It's delicious, thanks. And, uh, ogres. I think about it. Quite. Alright, transfer, if you can get me some trash. And you have to get it because I have to stay with the glider. Is it a deal? I'll get you some trash. Wonderful, my friend. Wonderful. Fine, it's over. And damn wolves. Infestation. Just slaughter them all. But then they're just gonna come back. I'm surprised one of these hasn't gobbled up my kitten yet. So, you can make super Guthix rests, apparently. What? Arheen. Rope. That would make sense uh, if the fisherman made the rope, because, you know, trawling nets and such. 
but we'll find out that this is not Arhim this time, though. So, if you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. See ya.